In spring of 2019, Zephyr Wellness and Walk the Talk America partnered in order to bridge the gap between guns and mental health. A lot of people wonder what the big deal is. Well, for far too long, there's been this self-imposed chasm between the mental health world and the firearms world. Tragedy strikes, it involves a firearm. Gun community blames the mental illness. Mental health world blames the gun. Nothing happens and life moves forward only to invite more tragedy. We decided that should stop. And specifically, we're going to focus on suicide prevention. Did you know that the first October of 2017 shooting in Las Vegas, widely known as the biggest mass shooting in American history, killed 58 people plus the shooter for 59? Did you also know that on a daily basis, on average, across the country, in America, we have 58 deaths by firearm suicide alone? Firearm suicide, not all suicides. But essentially, we have a 1st of October shooting every day in America, only it doesn't make headlines. We want to change that, too. We want to bring awareness to this topic. We want to bring firearm safety to those who own firearms. We don't want to infringe on anybody's rights. That's not constitutional. What we do advocate is more responsibility. We also advocate for a demystification of the counseling process. People should not be afraid to go get counseling help because they think they're going to be stigmatized or that somehow I as a practitioner is going to pick up the bat phone to the government and have your guns taken away simply because you have anxiety or PTSD from combat. Did you also know, speaking of combat, that the veteran community commits suicide at a very high rate and among those suicides that are completed, 70% are completed by firearm. That's not acceptable. No preventable deaths are acceptable. We want to try to change the course of the dialogue and the course of the interventions. We invite you to help us. The way you help us is myriad of ways. You can donate, certainly. Our efforts cost money. Please give your contributions in cash or credit or check. But we also invite you, if you're a mental health practitioner, you're checking this out for the first time, get on board. I myself have often said that I had to come out of the closet, so to speak, as a gun-owning practitioner because my own community was full of fear about what guns meant. I didn't want to be ostracized professionally. And then I said, hell with that. I'm going to come out and talk about how I'm a firearms-owning clinician and I can speak fluently in the vernacular of firearms so that I can help prevent people from killing themselves. That might be families with teenagers who are depressed, who aren't storing their guns properly. It might be the veteran who's discharged from combat. It might be the police officer who's stressed from the job. No one needs to die, especially by firearm. But what we need to do is we need to increase capacity for our clinical understanding of culture and competence in that culture. Please join us at Walk the Talk America. Please join us through Zephyr Wellness. You can reach out to me at info at zephyrwellness.org. Ask how you can get involved. Go to wtta.org to get involved. Anyhow you do it, we welcome your contributions. We want to fight this. We want to win. And we definitely, absolutely want to keep people alive. But not just that, improve their lives afterward so they're no longer suicidal. Thanks for watching. I'm Jake Wiskirchen. We wish you all great mental wellness.